I'm Abby Anderson. I'm the executive director of the Congaree Vista Guild, um, and we are a 501c6 nonprofit organization that's membership based. And our purpose here is to help promote um, the Vista area and the happenings on and the historic aspects of it. Well, the Vista has been around for quite some time. Um, the Vista area was started as a um, it's where all the artists used to come. Um, back when there were still train tracks running through the Vista, artists could come and you could get space for like a dollar a square foot. And so it was the cheapest place in town where artists could come. And so they were just buying up all the properties and having studios and art galleries here. Um, the train tracks on Lincoln Street went away and then it kind of became a more populous place where a lot more people wanted to come. So a lot of the artists had to move out because it became a lot more expensive for them to be here. We still do have a lot of art galleries and artists, but that is kind of where we started was it really, the artists helped make it the cool part of town that people really wanted to come to. We do different things. Um, our development committee specifically meets and we talk about different things that we can do to work with the Department of Transportation or the city to try to make it more pedestrian friendly around the area. We're also working on a lot of connectivity. Um, it would be easier if we could connect with the Main Street District. Um, we are right adjacent to them, but Assembly Street is very wide and it's kind of hard to cross sometimes. Um, so we spend a lot of time working on those things. If it's not marketing and events, we spend a lot of time working on those folks to just try to make this a more friendly and enjoyable place for all of our visitors to come to. So we have a lot of exciting stuff. We have a lot of new businesses that are coming in. Um, some are chains, and then we have some that are some really great new concepts for Columbia um, of different restaurants. We just opened a farmer's market. Um, we still have a lot of those art galleries and things that are putting on events every single month. Uh, we still do Artista Vista and Vista Lights, um, which we've been doing for 35 plus years on both of those events. Um, so we've got a lot of great things coming. There's a lot of growth coming to our area. So new businesses that were here um, that even opened up this summer, we have the Dragon Room, um, which is a new Christ Christian Nimi restaurant. The Farmer's Market Exchange just opened in early September. Um, and then coming up, we've got Rebel Dogs is coming, which is a new hot dog place down on Yuji Street. Uh, Biddy and Bo's is the new coffee shop that's coming to the Vista. That's a chain, but um, they are locally owned. And then the hollow is also coming soon. And that is where the old Jason's Deli location was on Gervais Street. So that's a forest to table. You can have rabbit and quail and some other different kind of options. But the Vista is a great spot where you can come and you can bring your family. You can just come with your friends or you can have a date night out. Um, we've got a lot of restaurants here that have been open for 30 plus years. Motor Supply is a fabulous option um, for, a, for a great dinner on town. We've also got some new Restaurants that are here like City Grit, that is a James Beard Award finally, or finalist. And so that is a great option for people to come to as well. Bring your family. We've got the Vista Greenway. That's about two miles of a trail that you can take um, that used to be the old railroad. Uh, or hit the State Museum and or Adventure. And then come up, have some lunch at um, any of our fabulous restaurants, 929 is a great option for that, or even just um, Menkoi Ramen. So there's a lot of different places. You head over to Colonial Life, you can see a basketball game, you can see a concert, or the Coger Center and enjoy Broadway in Columbia. So you can go and find out more information on about the Vista at vistacolumbia.com and also follow us on our social media pages. On Instagram, it's at the Vista SC. Um, and then what really helps our businesses the most is just coming down and enjoying what we have going on. If you're coming down for a concert or a basketball game, make sure to stop in and have dinner at one of our restaurants um, and just help support these local businesses.